Hello, Invu creators. Today I'll be showing you how to create your own unisex eyes. This does not require you to create any sort of mesh. It is something you can do right in the Invu editor. You can start by driving right from the Invu base. And maybe you've tried this before where you have put in the code for the other gender. And maybe you put on the avatar, like a, in this case it would be a male one. And then you see this and think that it works, but as soon as you do something like put on a head or actually go to use them, you'll find that it doesn't work. This is actually because the assets have different names for the male and female avatars, which you can actually see over in the debug here. And this is where you can actually compare the two. And so you can actually go in and in this case make the male one. And when you go over to the debug here, you can see that it actually has a different name. Whatever they decided that boggles my mind, but it was 2005. So what we've got to do is we've actually got to copy over the assets from the one onto the other. So you'll have to make a new material slot by pressing add key. And you just basically copy down the other one, except for you add one instead of zero. Then you have to add an asset. Well, it has to be exact, so capital there. And then that's where you paste the one from the other, in this case, the male dot anime eyes, blah, blah, blah. And you'll have to give it a new index number as well. It doesn't have to be 30. <laughs> then you press apply changes, and you can see it does have its own slot there. It is the default blue. And so you can check to at uh, any point uh, by changing like the avatars. You can always, ooh, those fingers. You can always go uh, back and forth to make sure that you didn't accidentally screw up something along the way. It can happen to any of us. <laughs> oh, it's just freaking me out looking at those things. Uh, oh. <laughs> okay, well, here you'll have to uh, upload your textures. This video isn't on how to make textures, so I actually already prepared kind of a simple one here and you can see it was in the male slot and you'll have to also add it to the female slot you can make them different if you want for whatever reason but now you can see it's applied to the female avatar oh and uh have to change the avatar again back over to the male avatars here uh i don't know uh this one i guess one that's not waggling its fingers <laughs> and then you can put on a head and you can see that the eyes are on both of the avatars genders because they decided to make it that way instead of just making it uh, so you can use everything unisex but like that was 2005 people <laughs> and you can also do the same for the other ones here by basically putting in the opposite so go over here, click this, override, and then just uh, control C to copy it, close it. You don't have to change anything there. And again, you just make the asset again by adding a new material ID there, this time with the female one. <laughs> and then index. Again, this number doesn't matter too much. It's good to... Uh, make it a little bit higher you don't want to put it on like a skin one uh, as you can see this one actually didn't load the material name there in that case you'll have to do it manually by uh, making sure that your texture has the appropriate name you can always check the materials here to make sure you have the right name for each slot and again like all you have to do is uh, make sure that you have both of the uh, codes down 80 for female 191 for male and always check with the avatars as you can see here it loads the female one there and pick a female head oh which one of these are female there <laughs> and with the female head you can see that the texture loaded in properly and when you have that all load it up you just submit and it will still be stuck in either the male or the female category but you'll be able to use it with whatever gender avatar you have on you don't even have to submit it in both categories 
I just wanted to show you. Well, I hope you learned something today, and remember, always have fun with your creating.